My advantage for this season is my mental approach to things. Just because of what I have to do on a day-to-day -day basis, I'm trying to save lives. And the same thing goes for people with military background as well. You have to make very concise, thought out, and effective decisions. Everything that I'm gonna be doing will be very intentful. Definitely not the prettiest, but I think it'll do what I need it to. All right, the last task, shelter task for today is to dig the fire pit. So it's gonna start around here and around here. And I want it to be at least the depth of the stick. So let's start digging. Coming from a military background that operates in a very cold environment, I know what components and what concepts make really warm shelters. One of them is sleeping high and having your pit low. That way you're not sleeping in a cold gap. That reduces your chance of getting frostbite and it increases your ability to rewarm yourself. So having that pit way beneath you, having that heat rise to exactly where you're sleeping, just increases your chance of being warm. As the time passes, it's gonna be super important because it's getting colder really fast. I guess this is actually turning into a form of a Dakota fire pit. I'm gonna have one um, inlet that goes right to the base of the fire, one outlet towards the, the middle to help with the smoke. And I'll be able to put my pot somewhere around here, have that flames feed it, and funnel all that smoke out that way, your ground chimney. And then I'll fortify that with some of the river clay to make it fire safe. I wanna grow from this. I wanna know myself better. All right, I'm gonna fire it up a little bit, let it warm. There we go. Thank you very much. All right, guys, this is officially home. <laughs>